Hi everyone, welcome to Gnan Cloud Garage. In this session, I'm going to talk about how to resolve the vCenter WAMI login error. WAMI means vCenter appliance management interface, login error containing exception in invoking authentication handler, user password expire. So the error screenshot is looks like this. VMware vCenter server management, WAMI page login. So when we try to log in with the root password, it's giving, this is the error message. Exception in invoking authentication handler, user password expired. So we are unable to log into the graphical user interface. So in order to resolve this error, only the solution is we have to connect to the vCenter server appliance command line, and then we can change the password. So let me log into our lab system. Let's say our server IP address is, ends with 45. So once we log in, it clearly says you are required to change your password immediately because password is expired. So we can enter the current password So now it is prompting for new password. So it is prompting us to change the new password actually. So I'm trying to give in the same as previous kind of password. Let me change. Now I am typing a new password. So password is changed. So let me re-log in with the new password. See password is changed. When you type shell, we are able to log in. Generally, in order to change the password, by default, when we are trying to connect using command line, it prompt to change the password. That is one method. Just in case, if you want to change manually again, the command is passwd space root. We can use this command to change the password. Okay, so password is changed. It's saying that password has been already used. So it is asking us to change the another one because uh, it's not accepting the previous password. Okay. So anyhow, I given the new password while logging in. Now to verify the password expiry information, you can type the command change hyphen L space. We have to type root. So now you can see password expires is the date is until the February 24, 2024. So we have 90 days time. Okay, now the this same information, now we can try to log into the portal again. So HTTPS colon slash slash 192.168.243.45 and for WAMI page, we have to use 5480 port. So now try to log in with the root and password. When we log in, we are successfully log in this time. And to verify the access information, it's already logged in. And the password expires is yes, and password validity is 90 days. Generally, organization, every organization recommend to change password for every 90 days. If you want to set for unlimited also, you can edit and set it to the longer period as well, but that is not recommended for production environment. Okay, so hope you understand how we can change the password using the command line access. 
and the remember the main password command is pssWD space root and to verify the password expiry information chage hyphen l space root okay and then we are successfully verify the password login using port number vami page port number is v center ip address colon 5480 we are able to successfully log in with new password and we validated the password validity until the 90 days even if you want to change it to never expires also we can edit but that is recommended only for the test and environment for production and environment we always recommend to change for every 90 days okay so that's it so back to our slide Similar to this, if you want to explore a additional VMware concepts like uh, VMware vSphere 7, vSphere 8, and also ARIA automation, NSX, storage virtualization, VMware Cloud Foundation, and other technical concepts. So just search in YouTube NAND Cloud Garage and go to the playlist tab. Whatever the concepts you are interested, you can just explore all these videos. It will be useful for you. And thank you. If you're watching this video first time, please do view, like, share, and subscribe to the Grand Cloud Garage channel. If you're already subscribed, I appreciate all your support. Bye for now.